If you have a limited size of 4GB RAM installed on your PC, so in this video I'm gonna show you how you can get more FPS and smooth gameplay experience in Fortnite. So guys before starting this video please let me know your PC specs in the comment down below and I will help you to optimizing your PC for free. So guys in the very first step we need to reduce the number of processes running on our PC that will directly reduce the usage of our RAM. And guys here you can check it out here in the system tray there is a lot of application is running in my background so guys let's fix it so guys in the very first step right click on your taskbar and open up the task manager now you need to go for straight toward your startup applications tab and there you will find out all the installed applications available on your pc and here you can check out here the status of every application available on your pc now you need to click on the startup impact and this will sort it from the high impact to no impact now you need to simply disable all the application that is useless for you. Like here we go to our Epic Games Launcher and we do not want to run it in the background every time we turn on our PC. So for that go for it and disable Epic Games Launcher from your PC. After that here we got light shoot. It has medium impact and also it is useful for me. So therefore I am not disabling it. And guys other than that I have disabled all these application on my PC. Now in the next step we are going to set up the virtual memory on our PC. So for that guys you need to go for your Windows start icon. Right Right click here and open up your system settings now you go for this advanced system settings you will find out here this kind of the pop-up now go for performance settings and open up the advanced tab now once you are here you need to go for this virtual memory option go for this change button and here you will find that virtual memory window now in the very first step uncheck this box that is automatically change manage pitching file size for all drive now select out here your C drive where you install your windows and now you need to go for this custom size option. By default it is onto the system main size but you need to set it onto the custom size. Now you need to use here value I will suggest you. So for that you need to open up the calculator. So go for your window search, open up the calculator on your PC and now do here these calculations according to your 4 GB size of the RAM. If you have 8 GB, 16 GB so you can ask me in the comment section then I will tell you how you can do it. So now simply guys type here size of your RAM so I have 4 GB of the RAM now multiply with the 1024 therefore we can convert over 4 GB RAM into MBs now hit equal after that you will get here the size of your RAM in MBs now multiply this number with 1.5 and hit equal and here we got over this number now you need to go for it simply type here 6144 after that now you need to again type here 10096 so guys clean it now type here 4096 and multiply this number with 2 and hit equal and here we go to the double size of your RAM in MB. So guys you need to go for maximum size, type here 8192, after that hit on the set button and apply the settings on your PC. Now in the next step you need to download the Wise Game Booster on your PC. This is one of the free optimization tools that can help you to optimize your any PC or your overall Windows performance. You can find out this application from the link in the description. Simply go there and download and install this tool on your PC. After installation, here you will find out this kind of interface. You need to go for the My Games tab. Here you will find out Add Game option. And here go for System Optimizer, Process Optimizer, and Service Optimizer. Now, first of all, go for My Game option and open up the Add Game tab. Now you need to locate the directory where you install your Fortnite. So go for your This PC. Now go for C Drive, Program File. Epic Games, Fortnite, Fortnite Game, Binary, Win64 and here we got our Fortnite client Win64Shipping.exe. So guys click on this open button and add here that specific game. Here we got the name that is the Unreal Engine. So guys once you have added here this application now you need to go for this option that is optimize all. This will optimize 25 items, 16 processes and 3 services that can be ended. You guys click on this optimize all button and this will start optimizing so guys once you click on this optimize all button this will close all the processes and application running on your pc after that here you can check it out here congratulations no item need optimization no process need ending and guys one service can be ended and guys one is still running on your pc and we have saved around three four seven six mb of the data from our pc so guys now let's go for the next step that is the services, process optimizer and services and this will do everything for you in just one click. 
So guys, once you have done it, now you click on this minimize button. And guys, this application will keep running in your background after optimizing your PC. So guys, now the next step, we are going to optimize our Windows registry settings, especially for our RAM optimization. So for that, you need to go for your Windows search, search for registry editor and make sure to run this as administrator. Copy the path from the website, link available down in the description. Simply guys, paste here this path and press enter. It will take you into this directory and now here you need to find out NTFS memory usage. So guys, here we got our NTFS memory usage. So right click here, go for modify option and here you will find out this pop up and you need to change this value data onto the 2 after that set the base onto the hexadecimal and hit ok and guys that's it now for the next step you need to copy the second path from the description and guys simply paste it here and press enter and the setting will help you to increasing your system cache by enabling the settings increase the system cache allowing window to cache more data in ram which can improve your pc performance so guys once you open up this directory now you need to find out here last system cache so here we got over this registry now simply right click here go for modify by default this value onto the zero but guys you need to change it onto the one set the base onto the hexadecimal hit ok and close out of your registry window now in the next step we are going to optimize our windows visual settings so for that you need to go for your windows start icon right click here and open up system settings after that go for advanced system settings so you will go here this pop up go for the performance settings and here you will find out all the visual related settings of your windows now if you have a low end pc i suggest you to go with adjust for the best performance this will disable all the visuals effect on your pc but guys as a content creator i need better visuals to make my video looks good so therefore i am going with the adjust for the best appearance but as a gamer you need to always go with adjust for the best performance for having the best performance out of your pc after that click on the supply button and hit ok so guys now the next step we are going to remove all the unused application from our pc that is also eating a lot of our memory resources so go for your windows start icon open up your windows settings and here you will find out this app tab so guys go for it now go for install app and here you will find out all the applications installed on your pc now find out here all the unused applications so guys here we have this intel driver and sports system i am not using it for a while so guys go for three dots click on the uninstall and uninstall all these kind of application from your pc this is also running in our background so guys therefore it is important to uninstall in this application so click on the uninstall button so guys like this uninstall all these applications from your pc that you are not using from a while after that now close out of your windows settings so guys now the next step we are going to disable our fortnite fso settings so for that you need to go for your file explorer now you need to go for your this pc and open up the c drive where you install your fortnite go for program file epic games fortnite fortnite game folder now go for binary win64 scroll a little bit down and here you'll find out your fortnite launcher file now right click here open up the properties of your this file now go for the compatibility and check mark onto the disable full screen optimization after that go for change high dpi and also check mark onto the override high dpi scaling behavior now hit ok hit apply click ok and close out of this window and now you need to simply one time reach to your pc therefore all this should take effect after that launch your fortnite and enjoy the best performance out of your pc so please let me know your input about this video in the comment below so i'll see you again in the next video